charge. Do you want me to adjust my natural shooting mode? It's not like I'm practicing for four-point plays. I'm practicing to make shots. <laughs> Charge call. Literally turn to the right, which does extend my right leg. Maxi can't get that the ball. Charge to rebound. Maxi hasn't slows everything down, but I think it's it's a good rule change. Pajemski, nice pass from Charge. Uh, Pajemski puts it up and in. With Quinones in a box and one on Tyrese Maxi. Charge connects on the three. That's the first three pointer by either team. Charge gathers and banks it home. Of course, again. And yet, I was blindsided, to be honest, by both. Uh, I, Orlando to Milwaukee in my seventh year as Philly creates another turnover for a little highlight here. But you, you've done a lot of thinking and, and research about how trades impact winning a championship. In, in terms of high-impact players, there's five or six examples in NBA history. The entire history of the NBA where an in-season trade helped a team win a championship. Marcus Gasol and two, where your seating is in the playoffs and where you, your place. Sharks, nice defensive play. Corey Joseph in the game with Quinones. Moody, Quinones throws it up and knocks it in. He's got 13 points, four assists in 24 minutes off the bench. You just have no margin for error. As you said, Steve Kerr very happy with what's going on. As we're under three minutes to go. You think of how horribly they watched her play in the Olympics. Walked it away off. Of course, Leandro Barbosa, part of the Golden State Warriors. Clearly, a lot of the fans have already left the disappointed. It's been, as we said, a rough couple of weeks for the Sixer fans. Count that.